Hey everyone, Daniel Edmondson here. How you doing? I'm here with another tip of the week from my studio. Thank you for sharing this time with me. What I want to talk about today is your paintings. I can see so many people are become so focused on the end product that they forget to enjoy what's really important. And let me go on to say that you don't really even own your paintings. The paintings that are on your wall in your living room or hanging in your studio, you really only experience those for the moments that you walk by for that 30 seconds or 10 seconds where you look at it and you say, hey, yeah, I painted that. Cool. I'm, I'm pretty good. I'm very proud of myself. And you should be. You should really relish those victories when you have them. But my point isn't that. My point is your life is made up of these moments you know every moment connects to the next moment which connects to the next moment which connects to the next moment and when you take that collection of moments that is what becomes your life right sort of like be here now you know be in live in the present because you can't live in the future you can't live in the past you can only live in the now right so what happens is when people are painting their paintings they get so focused on the end that they forget to enjoy the middle, which is the, the process of the painting, right? So let's say that you're going to spend 20 hours on this painting and really, you know, really, you're going to spend 20 hours on this painting. Let me refresh this. You're going to spend 20 hours on this painting and then you're going to take it and put it on your wall. And then you're going to enjoy it for 10 second clips for however long until you as long as you own it until maybe you sell it or give it away or whatever you do with it, right? But it won't compare to those 20 hours of solid time that you are in front of the painting. So really when I say that you don't really even own the painting, you don't because really the only thing you really own about the painting is the process of painting it, right? Because that's 20 hours of time of moment to moment that you've put into that painting as opposed to 10 seconds here and there when it's on your wall that you see it. So it's so important to create and come, come up with a process. Boy, that was loud. Come up with a process that you really, truly enjoy. And that way you will get the absolute most out of your painting experience. So how do you fix the process? One, come up with a technique that you like and you enjoy doing. Secondly, is you know, make your studio this perfect environment, the right kind of lighting, the right kind of temperature, the right kind of music, whatever you want on the walls, just so you really enjoy it. And some people don't like painting by themselves, so invite friends over to your studio. And you spend so much time painting that you really do want to make it as an enjoyable process as you can and really just have fun and um and while you're in in that moment don't focus on the end focus on where you're at right now and if it isn't going good well just have the guts to say hey it's not going that good but it's going to come out of it and i'm going to enjoy it and i'm enjoying it now and you'll enjoy the process a lot more and really in the long run you'll end up painting better because you enjoy the process so much well that's Dan with another tip of the week. You have a fantastic day, and thank you always for sharing time with me.